Give me that. We've got to seal the doors. Okay. There have been noises at the other entrance. They're trying to break it. Damn it. Do something. Oh, shit. The other. Oh, no. Broset. You are. You are super mad. All right. We need a Mortal Kombat. Some two of you. Ah, fuck this. You, you guys can stay here. I'm going. I got shit to do. Oh, good. A save point. I love saving. Those damn fish. Oh, hey, we're back up here. Cool. Alright, so I guess now we just chill out and wait for the boat to reach the reef. I'm, I'm forced to assume it's just going to be the rest of it's just going to be a nice peaceful voyage with nothing eventful whatsoever. I can just sort of chill out on the deck and enjoy the lovely corpses and weather and just wait and... Whoa, shit, what the fuck? There's something coming! Oh, you motherfucker, you're welding me outside? That's just rude. It's raining out here. I'm gonna get moist. You're about to get fucking murdered, though. So I guess uh, I guess that works out in the end. Oh, you got fucked up, son. Holy sh! Holy! Oh, what the sh! Yeah! Should I get me anything? Took over. I just knew the answer was the fucking cannon. Cannons are always the answer. Uh, is my... Am I gonna get... No, I loaded the door, so I shouldn't get it today. Oh! Holy! Holy crap! Yeah, canister! Oh! I, how? I need to dodge that, but I don't know how. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, apparently it doesn't do enormous amounts of damage, despite being... Jai! Oh, no! Where can I go to heal? Uh, because I need to not bleed to death. That would be important. Okay, okay. He shouldn't be able to hit me from all the way over there. I just want to heal myself! Leave Jack alone! Okay, here we go. We got this. We got this. He's not gonna- he's not gonna want me. I'm healing. We'll be fine. Oh, okay. He doesn't come in the same place twice, and so if I go over here, I'll be safe. Yeah, but he's gonna shake the boat again. Grab on, Jack! Grab on! Alright, I need to get him to come around the front. Maybe I can lure him there if I run up here. Hey, bro! Okay, okay. Get away from that. Get away. Get away, Jack. Whoa! Alright. Need, need to get him on the front of the boat. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to shoot him precisely three times. Alright, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Get in the cannon. Get in the cannon. Get in the cannon. Boom! You son of a bitch. Yeah. How does it feel? How does it feel? Probably not great. All right. Maybe, uh, maybe I can convince him to uh, to attack the front twice. Whoa, whoa! Easy there, killer. Easy there, killer. This is Dagon, the man himself, trying to fuck up my day. I recognize this giant fishy asshole. Trust me, I know a lot about fishy assholes. Just keep moving. All right, come back, come back to the front of the ship. I'm guessing third time's gonna be the charm. This being a boss battle. Easy there, easy there. Get the cannon, Jack. Get the cannon. You can just shoot. Wow, he just fucking disappeared out of existence. Oh, right, there he is. You mad, bro? Oh man, he's so mad. Look how mad this guy is. Oh, holy, holy shit, he's mad. Whoa, easy there, Jack. Don't fall out of the boat. I think Jack fell out of the boat. That's not. That's not gonna be good. That's gonna be quite bad, actually. Shout out of time too. Jack, you need to swim! Oh, I remember a place that looked like this way back at the start of the game, the cultist house.
Was that level called a shadow of time? When our foe moved on land, we would track them by the strange footprints they left in their wake, consisting of five circular toe marks. They were blind, yet had exceptional sensitivity to both motion and sound. In battle, these creatures could harness the power of the winds with terrifying precision. It wasn't until the great energy weapon was developed that we had the means to fight their evil. Then we were able to drive them down deep into the catacombs beneath their basalt towers, sealing all routes with impenetrable trap doors. Yeah, this this place. Whoa, getting sucked through that that gateway. Oh, oh, I know approximately what's going on here. Get the fuck this morning. It'd help if you knew a bit about the mythos in general. Basically, Jack, I'm got abducted. I'm sure the game will make all clear eventually. Devil's Reef. The land itself seemed wrong in some subtle way that I could not precisely define. The moonlight fell at an unnatural angle. And then I wasn't able to read in time. Alright, I guess I washed up on the reef after I was done tripping bowls and remembering time from those uh, six years, was it, that I lost? I know what happened there. Approximately. The Reef of Satan. February 10th, 1922. Early evening. Did I really see what I think I saw? Or was it another hallucination? I can't be sure any longer. Surely these things can't exist in the rational universe, but then... How can the human imagination, even an insane one, produce such horrors? And why do some of the things, the shape... The words they use seem so familiar. That's the question that's eating at me. Are they connected to my lost memories? And if so, what on earth happened to me during the six missing years? Or was it even on Earth? I need to get a grip on myself and look for any other survivors from the wreck of the Urania. I hope I'm not alone on this hellish rock with these... these... things. I must be careful, though. I've seen for myself what they do to unwelcome visitors. I wasn't fucking invited. Alright, well... Some of the wreckage from the Urania has floated ashore. Sure has. Okay, um... Bam! Shotgun. This should defend me from any fish people that I happen to encounter here. in here. Maybe a save point? No, a medical kit. Well, that's pretty good, too. Not quite as good as a save point, but medical kits are pretty, pretty, uh, pretty damn handy to have around. We do much we appreciate them. Oh, what the fuck? Well, I guess he made it short. Body's been mutilated. No shit, Sherlock. Jack Walters. Private dirt. What the hell? Oh! Ah! Oh, fuck! I fell in that pit. I wasn't paying enough attention. Dude. All right. Hopefully there is like an auto save when I arrived here on Tarif. All right. Good. Let's just uh, skip this. Can't skip this. You're gonna be okay, Jack. Just calm down and don't fall into the pit of spikes next time or get fucked up by those various traps. And then derp. 
All right. Yeah, yeah. Okay, crawl in here. Go get the medical kit. Do do do. Finally, seems to actually be nighttime. Billy, no! Alright, so. What's the deal here? Whoa. What the hell? Alright. How am I supposed to dodge that? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Until now. Let's go ahead and heal myself and then save up. I don't know how much longer I'm going to keep playing, just for the moment. Probably not much. I have other tasks that I must complete today. I've been, uh, been playing Call of Cthulhu. The winds here are fierce, and there isn't much shelter ahead. I need to be careful. Alright, cool. Whoa! Easy there, killer. Alright, I guess we're taking the low road. Oh no! Jack, swim for your destiny! He couldn't swim for his destiny, guys. He let himself drown to not have a destiny anymore. Alright, maybe, can I... I need to be careful. Jump? Alright, let's go nice and slow. Nice and easy, Jack. Okay, here we go. Here's some shelter. Well, apparently the wind is still fucking with my day. It's down here. Oh, those fucking starfish. Yeah, get on my face. No! You son of a bitch! Get off! Get off! Get! Get off! Son of a... Get, get off there! My eye is bleeding. It's not too bad, though. It's okay. I'm just gonna leave that. Oh, we got murals. Look at oh my Jake. god. Fishmen breeding with humans. So that's one way to. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's pretty much what's going on there. Cool. Not, not really cool, but cool. There is a disc missing from the engraving. So there's a couple missing. Do you have any kind of discs now? The mural shows humans worshiping the fishmen and Dagon. What's this? An old pulley. Pulley. I'm sure that's going to be needed for something. The rock surface the mural is set on seems to be slightly worn. Whoa. Alright. So I'm going to avoid getting starfish on my fucking... Uh, God damn it! I wonder if there's anything I can do to prevent that. It's just annoying. Getting starfish on my face. I never asked for this. Whoa! Easy there, killer. Let's not walk into those spikes with these spikes. Oh, these uh, these planks are slippery. Whoa, jeez. And this place is dangerous. Oh, h &S violations all over the shop. Is that a person? No, it's just rocks. All right. Oh. Well, I'm going to call it a, uh, a bit for that, folks. I will, uh, I will see you next time. Trouble T Cat out.